It is the winds today, and that's bringing in not only gusty conditions, but cold air along with it. You can see all of that colder air to the northwest that's being drug in by that stiff breeze. 29 right now in the metro. Iowa Falls at 28. Look at the wind gusts to 41 miles an hour for Carroll. 33 in the metro, 36 in Ames. Got that winter storm warning in effect. Areas highlighted in pink look to pick up the most snow. Could pick up more than half a foot of snow. You combine that with the wind too, likely leading to blowing snow. As we head throughout the remainder of your day, plan on temperatures hovering around freezing for a bit. Not a lot of sunshine to be had out there. Again, though, your morning commute tomorrow likely to be very difficult. After that, we're cold for a couple days. Temperatures back in the middle 40s by this weekend. All right, if you're on 235 heading east toward downtown, a little bit of a slowdown right now. You can see over by the West Mixmaster, but it's cleared up pretty good. Remember that state tournament is in town, so that's going to make traffic very busy on 235. So you can see cars flowing at 63rd Street and congested traffic at 22nd Street, but mostly good around the metro, Eric. This morning, there's breaking news coming from Madison County, where a winter set home is likely destroyed after a fire this morning. Rodney Weir took this picture of the home on West Fillmore Street overnight. You can see it was fully engulfed in flames early this morning. This is what the home looks like now. A lot of just charred rubble out there. Well, Winterset Fire tells us no one was inside, but a few dogs were rescued from that home. Firefighters think a floor furnace may have started that fire. We'll follow that throughout the day.